Hello everybody in this new tutorial of Angular 8 and ASP.NET Core So to make a site web with Angular we need to install Node.js version 10.9 or later So here we navigate to the node.org website and let's download uh, the Windows version So this will take few minutes, click finish, and we need eventually an editor, so let's uh, choose Visual Studio Code, it's a free EDE, next, next, and next. So Visual Studio Code is a very nice EDE. I can help. It can help a developer in many shortcuts and uh, something uh, is something awesome. So now we need to install the CLE command line interfaces of Angular. So let's navigate to Visual Code create a new folder in which we'll make our repository so let's choose let's create a new folder which called angular and choose it so on the top menu let's select a new terminal and let's go to the site of Angular and copy this command in order to install the CLE. So the term npm is not recognized. So we need to restart the visual code after the installation of um, Node.js. So here in the terminal um, we need to rewrite or paste the command install Angular CLE. This will install all Angular models. Um, so it will take some few minutes. So here you ask me to share anonymous users data with Angular Teams at Google. So uh, I say no. So now we need, uh, we, so we need to, to create a new application, new Angular application. That's why we need to say ng command new the name of your uh, application let's say forms I ask me to to uh, ask me for adding the routing in the project to so say yes That's cool. So need, now we need to to navigate to the created web, website, which called Forms. So CD Forms. And now we need to launch the application. So the ng serve command uh, open will compile the application or the website and launch 
the site web of the navigator so it's building the application here it takes some few minutes the first time and here we have our website default uh, template thank you very much see you next tutorial angular with asp.net core